Hey, beautiful people. Welcome or welcome back to the channel. I'm Josie with Awakened Soul. If you're new here, I hope you're having an amazing day or night whenever you're watching this. We're here for a check-in on your person. I'm pulling their thoughts, feelings, and intentions towards you to get to the bottom of what's going on in this situation right now. We have the Nine of Cups and the Hermit, okay? I feel like you are showing this person how to really do deep dives within themselves. You've inspired them to do a deep look and introspect more, okay? You're like pulling out the best and worst qualities in this person and they know that and they're, they're becoming more conscious of it and really trying to get to like the bottom of that, okay? We have strength and the magician coming out as well. Um, like, I'm not going to lie to you, you guys. There's something about this connection that feels one of a kind to this person. It feels magical, but it's also incredibly triggering for them. And I think that sometimes that's very overwhelming and they don't know what to do because it's like you're almost mirroring their best and worst qualities to them. And, you know, when it looks bright and they're happy about what they're seeing, they're excited and they're ready to move things forward. But then when they see something that they don't want to see, it's causing them to retreat and retract and they want to like avoid it and shut down instead. So what I'm really seeing is your person going through this internal battle over and over and over again. Um, and it might feel to you like you guys are going through cycles with each other. And that's because what your person is experiencing is very cyclical in nature. They're like bouncing back and forth between seeing the best of themselves, the worst of themselves. I feel like they are honestly like on this roller coaster where they don't quite know how to feel half the time because it's so polarizing. One minute they're on the top of the world, they're excited, they're eccentric, they're optimistic, and then the very next moment they feel like the world is crumbling beneath their feet. Like they just really don't know what to make of it. Um, but baseline, they do feel like this is significant, like they don't want to walk away from this connection, at least not right now, um, because they seem to know that it's happening for a purpose, okay? Let's get some messages from them. This has wanted to come out twice now. I'm open to compromise. So it does seem like your person wants to find a middle ground with you, okay? And when you have disagreements or you don't see eye to eye, I think that this person really does want to meet you halfway and figure out solutions that will work for both of you. Um, they don't want anyone in this connection to feel like they're giving more than the other. There's an important need for balance here, okay? Balance and reciprocation, mutual respect and understanding of each other. Um, this person seems to really value that and want that for the two of you, okay? I want to start a family with you. Um, very intense, okay? So for some of you out there, if that's something you're interested in, this person could want that with you. Or if you already have um, like children from other relationships 